That said, we have been to the Moth Cave, but maybe the, it's it's for something else. Okay. Oh, look at this. Imperial soldiers and everything. Effects of the Elder Scrolls? Okay. Yo, hang on. <laughs> what was a, a Moth Priest doing with the book Effects of the Elder Scrolls? Like, at that point, isn't it a little too late to just now be thinking like, Oh man, I'm gonna go blind? <laughs> When we had last left the last dragonborn, they reported back to Castle Volikar and Lord Harkon, who had a new plan. Yes, more machinations were to be in motion. Indeed, an Elder Scroll, no less, was required. Sight into the future, telling of secrets that could be used to benefit this brood of horrific vampire. But first, they would need to be able to find an Elder Scroll and read it somehow. So the last dragonborn set out in search of none other than an ancestor moth priest or a moth priest who could do exactly that. This is the Elder Scrolls V. Skyrim, welcome back. Zoop. And how cool was that? Saran actually had like a unique animation. Yeah, look at this. She's so ahead of things. They didn't do this with followers who uh, existed in... What do you call it? In Dragonborn DLC, did they? I guess because she's not like a formal follower in the same sense as like Cicera, right? Yeah. This is a lot more akin to how followers and such behave in Fallout 4, isn't it? Right? Yeah, she like goes around and interacts with the environment in ways. Yeah, look, she's just straight up chopping logs and shit. But yeah, earlier she was she was warming her hands at the fire pit. That's wild. What happens if we go too far while she's in the animation? Wow! She can even cut off the animation midway through. She doesn't have to chop like X amount of logs. Wow, the future is here. Just imagine all the weird and cool things they'll be able to do in Elder Scrolls 6. Right, yeah, look forward to that in Elder Scrolls 6, coming someday. <laughs> They're going to be able to... I don't know. <laughs> They're going to be able to give you a free hand job. Wow, awesome. I love Elder Scrolls 6 already. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's head over here. Is this is this actually the cave we're looking for already? Is this the place? Oh, look, it's not showing up. Okay. I mean, this has got to be it, right? That said, we have been to the Moth Cave, but maybe the, it's it's for something else. Okay. Oh, look at this. Imperial soldiers and everything. Effects of the Elder Scrolls? Okay. Yo, hang on. <laughs> what was a, a moth priest doing with the book Effects of the Elder Scrolls? You know, like it like at that point, isn't it a little too late to just now be thinking like Oh man, I'm gonna go blind? <laughs> Right, like, are you, like, at that point, can you even read it? Like, maybe you're already unable to read. You're, like, uh, your vision is, maybe you're not completely blinded by their magical power, but maybe, like, your vision is so myopic and blurred that you, that you can't read it, right? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, sure. It's, it's like if we went to, yeah, it would be like if we went to Castle Volokar and we saw in there, like, a whole bunch of books on, like, what it means to be a vampire. <laughs> Vampirism 101. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. It, very clearly a book placed for our benefit, I guess, right? Or maybe it belonged to the vampire, right? Maybe it belonged to the vampire. That feels, that feels unlikely. It feels, feels more likely that it would be traveling with the cart. Right? I mean, I guess maybe a vampire could have been on the card. Alright. Vampire's Note. I have new orders for you. Prepare an ambush just south of the Dragon Bridge. Take the Moth Priest to Forebear's Holdout for safekeeping. 
until I can break his will. Signed, Malchus. Who the hell is Malchus? Was it a rival vampire? Also, if they work for Malchus, then who the hell attacked him? Man. I guess moth priests are just like filled with oodles of blood. Because look at this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> look, and it stopped here. I guess they were able to like seal the wound. No, look, there's still <laughs> every so often it's just like squirting out. It's almost like they're like vomiting up blood, but that can't be. Right? Just every so often they get <laughs> they they have like an anime s geyser of Wait, what the hell? There's another cart over here. Was it like an entire convoy? What the hell? Mother? <gasps> look at this. Is this like Ancestor Moth Silk or whatever? Or is it just regular... Like, no, carpet? Alright. Red Guard here? Nothing on you, really? Sure. I guess this is where they're being held, then. And then maybe from here we'll head over to... That one area. Oh, look, yeah. Cool. Man, and this must have just got spawned into the world from uh, us being on this quest, right? Because we've been across this area in the past, right? I haven't seen anything like that. Alright. Wow. On the rock, too? Come on. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> what, did they originally not have a quest marker for this one? And you had to find it on your own? Is that why they were so egregious? With the, like, trail of blood? <laughs> okay. Okay. There we are. I mean, I know it's like the vampire DLC, so we gotta have blood everywhere, but come on. <laughs> Good lord. If we, if we went back to the, uh, Redwater Den or whatever the fuck, the weird, like, nasty geyser, if you like, if you if you go down and look down at the source of it, it's not actually some weird supernatural force producing it all. It's just an ancestor moth priest just kind of like stuck there, <laughs> nonstop like anime blood geysering. And look at that weird shit over there too. Okay. Yeah, I gotta say it thematically feels extremely weird doing this as a vampire because look at this it looks like like it, it thematically makes way more sense if we're dawn guard you know we roll up and we're like oh yeah let's go mess up some vampires you know whereas we're a vampire fighting other vampires when we have a clear enemy in the dawn guard you know i i kind of thought that it, the way it would go is like they would swap out all the npcs or whatever but these folks are clearly vampires right I don't know, maybe we'll go up there and it'll be like, Haha, we're actually Dawn Guard. we killed them all. Alright, let's find out. Anything else cool here? Oh, you know what? We should probably swap to vamp form. Oh shit, speaking of which, reminds me, folks have been writing in with information that in fact, Serana being with us nerfs our damage output from the, like, absorb health spell. So it, it's basically major garbage. Oh my gosh, this is just a dog. <laughs> Maybe it is the Dawn Guard. Who's there? Okay. That's the end of that. Jeez, we're just out here fucking killing dogs and shit. Was this The Last of Us Part 2 or what? Shit. <laughs> okay. What we got over here? Oh, look. We're resurrecting them as well. Cool. Yeah, I can get behind that. There we are. Yeah. Have a fun dog friend. Okay. I mean, I guess we do also have dogs, right? <laughs> they really wanted to make use of the dog rigging that they came up with, you know? Alright. 
go over here. I mean, these things are going to come to life, right? Shit, I don't know. Maybe not. Okay. Let's do a quick save in case things get ugly. Who's there? Are these Dawn Guard? Oh my god, they are! Wow, okay, Dawn Guard expansion. You've done it. You've fucking done it. Alright. I'm down. I'm down for it. Holy shit, they have power. Oh my god. Oh, dear lord. What's worse is that it doesn't even work all the time, right? Oh god, and now I'm like flying through the water zone. <laughs> this is worse than being a fucking werewolf, huh? Okay, let's try and get in here and mess him up. And it's a good thing we do have, like, so many followers because shit, I can't do ass on my own. Which dude is even getting messed up here? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'll show you what a real God. God. Can I just kite them? Can I kite them the whole way through town? Tank them, Vincent Van Gogh. Tank them. Thought I was supposed to be able to suck that man off to get health. Oh my gosh, I got smacked by the power troll. What the hell? What's even up with the Dawn Guard seeing the trolls thinking like, yeah, let's put armor on him? <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> Why the trolls? Who's there? They like, they eat people and shit. They're, they, I feel like they're a really bad pick to even begin from, right? Like the starting point is already so far gone. Try this. Maybe we need to swap to uh, hover mode and then go from there, right? And try to get the killing blow off that way. We don't even have like a double attack. There we go. Hell yes. Ooh. Definitely dodge that one as well. Oh my god. Okay. I, I suppose I don't have another perk I can take. <laughs> right? Yeah, okay. Alright. Sure. Alright. Can I power attack and suck off a troll? No. I think I even got the killing blow on it. All right. Oh, there's Cicero. Oh, there. Oh, shit. Get him, Vincent. Get him. I don't know. They No one's gonna get him out of here. Hey, what the fuck is going on? Now give me Hey, who all is talking right now? Is it the guy I'm fighting right now? Was that him talking? Is this- is this because Elder Scrolls shit's going on? Like, time is fucked up now? Yes, give me your power. Oh, maybe there's folks on the other side, like, way up there. You know? Maybe that's it. Okay. Let's revert our form. Good. I feel like when we do that, Maybe meat should just be, like, dropping off of us or something, you know? We should leave a little nasty pair of, like, chicken wings behind or something. <laughs> to show that we've transformed, you know? Because at least when you warp into a werewolf, you can see, like, your limbs elongating and, like, they even describe it in the books and stuff. How, like, the metamorphosis goes down. But for becoming a vampire, it's just like a nasty meat explosion or whatever, you know? It's just gross. <laughs> okay. Over this way. Which, you know what? I Fair enough. 
at least in Skyrim land, you know, the vampires are way more nasty than any of the werewolves combined, right? And we're talking about literally the members of the companions. Like, when they're in human form, they're probably nasty as hell, just as well. But the vampires are just next level. There's just, like, gore everywhere. They sound like, like a nasty meat whenever they transform. It's just a gross time all around. It's, it seems very unsanitary. Okay. Let's check up on these ramparts, I guess. Let's pop a quick save. Man. Maybe, I, I feel like I ought to be able to bring these dudes to life, you know, and fight for me. Like, if they're not gonna transform into living beings, maybe I should be able to do it. Have them help me. Alright. Well, we can go up that away. Do I want to, though? Serana's eyes got the vamp glow? Yeah, okay, they do. It's just checking. Maybe she was also a Dawn Guard spy. <laughs> Could you imagine? Man. The Dawn Guard spies are just at that next level. <laughs> oh, look, a steel bolt. Hmm. Let's do a quick save. They used the power of an Elder Scroll to transport a uh, Dawn Guard spy back through time, encasing them all those years ago inside of the weird little stone sarcophagus she was in. Deactivate the magic barrier. Oh, look, yeah, there's some a-holes here. Will they talk? Or are they just gonna... Okay, they're going hostile immediately. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do I have any, like, cool buffs I can cast ahead of time? Don't I have, like, uh... What was the one I used as a werewolf? Dragon Aspect? Uh, Hell yeah. That seems like a good one. And then I'm gonna vamp out. Oh! Cool. And then, oh my gosh, I can't see shit. So am I like, doing major damage now? This guy, whoever this is doesn't even have a name. Their name is literally just Dawn Guard. <laughs> Which, you know, fair enough, but... <laughs> it's wild how... <laughs> they don't have, like, a, a title or something to them. Where's the other one at? There you go. It's not like Dawn Guard... Warrior or whatever. Uh, extremely funny how we've got this, like, Morrowind ass enchanted glow now. Can I even hit this kid from here? Sounds like my hits aren't connected. Man, I am indestructible, though, with this. With my glow power. Dude, this guy has some health going on. Man, how many times I gotta, like, swipe at this asshole? Like, we're all laying into him. It's not just me, too. Gotta, like, run out of stam. Yes! Give me your power! Cool. Alright! Good. Hey, who the fuck is this guy? Can I suck him off too? Get his strength? No. Alright. Let's see, let's revert form here. There we are. Good. Okay. What have you got? You got anything good? You got some mead. Dawn Guard shield. Do I have a shield yet in my collection? I don't know that I do. Granted, it's not terribly hard to get the full set of Dawn Guard stuff as far as I remember. Okay. Good. Where have we seen this before? Was this, um... 
this the same effect that was used for the Eye of Magnus during the College of Winterhold arc? Is it just repurposed here? Is that what I'm thinking of? Hey, there's a guy in there! Oh, shit, it's the Moth Priest! Okay. Oh, it's Malchus as well. A vampire. Okay, Waystone Focus. Eee. Okay. Is it meant to be like alien shit? I mean, you know. Way, W-E-Y. That feels alien. Okay. Over here. What have we got? A garnet. Whoa! Two madness ore. Alright. Anything else? Bunch of coffins. Loads of them. Okay. Over this way, anything? Nah. And I said to Was that a little secret area over there? Yo, look at that. What is that? That's your wish. Yo, is that a little secret area? Okay. Hold up. Yeah, what is this? Is this like a fun little secret? Ooh, I'm getting a little drained, okay. Is there some kind of secret on this little platform? Wow, there is! Holy shit. Amazing. I bet there's secret stuff on top of that, too. Well, I don't know. How, how would I even reach up that high? I don't think I have a way of getting higher over there. Okay. Can I actually just make this jump? Oh, yeah, you can. Okay. Yeah, on that little uh, platform there. Is there actually a way up to that? The highest you can get over there is... Well, you can get up on top of that rail. Huh. Dude, you might be able to make it. Yeah, from this? Can you zoosh onto that? Hmm. Is there anywhere else that you could zoosh from? Maybe here. Yeah, and looking at it now? You might be able to, like, cling to the side. Okay. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Oh, fuck. Okay. Did not pan out. Okay, you know what? Instead of waiting for our cooldown, we'll just quick load it. Okay. Good. We'll try this. I feel like it's too far out from here, though. Yeah. Can't make that one. Alright. It is very neat that there's a little secret area there, though. Very much enjoy that. Alright. Chow down on some salmon while we're at it. And then let's get this uh, Moth Priest out of the weird little bubble. It is interesting that they... Like, is it intentional that they're using a similar looking magic as was used during the College of Winterhold arc? Are they tapping into something similar there? Or is it just them reusing the asset? <laughs> I don't know. Questions like these have plagued... Lore investigators for millennia. <laughs> okay. Let's see, we just socket it right in there. Yeah, there you go. But my master is dead, and his enemies will pay. What? Dexian Ethicus. Oh, they're enthralled. <laughs> okay, we gotta kill him? Shit. Okay. Oh, they were thralled by Malchus. Gotcha. Okay. Let's run over here. Let's 
What's his health look like? Okay. Not quite as rough as uh, some of the other dudes we've faced here. Oh, did my vampirism just now worsen? Need a sweet roll. Hang on. Oh, right. <laughs> okay. I, I still don't have another point, do I? Yeah. You're a carrot. I guess I gotta unvamp. There we are. Wow, we almost died. Okay, good. Go back into first person. Let's heal up. Good. Okay. What was our unit that we had gotten over here, though? Hmm. One was like seduction. Vampire seduction or something like that. Are we like really seductive now? Huh. Night Stalker's footsteps. I feel like we'd had that though. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I could have sworn it said seduction added. Oh, maybe it's a spell. Maybe it's a spell or a power. Is it? Like we can literally seduce someone to like do our dark bidding? Vampire sight? Oh, can we only seduce people when we look nasty? Wait, are we only seductive when we're like a gross guy? Hang on. What the hell? Let's start grossing out. All right. Yeah, let's go meat mode. Okay. No, I don't, I don't think so. Unless, is it over here somehow? How did I get, how did I get access to that? Oh, uh, did I? Well, no, I didn't suck them off. Yeah, I was about to say, maybe my powers went back the other direction because I, I did a sucking, but I, I didn't suck anybody. What the fuck? I could have sworn it said the top left, like, some kind of seduction, right? Okay. Let's warp back. Hang on, if, if we, if we just type in... Seduction. No. It's just dark seducers and stuff. What the heck? All right. Dexian. You're kind of a blight upon Tamriel, monster. Oh. If you think I'll help you, you're mistaken. If you think I'll help you, you're mistaken. Is it an item? Use your vampire seduction power on the moth priest. Yeah. So I, wait, how do I, how do I seduce this bald old man? <laughs> wow, I thought this would be a lot easier, but uh, evidently not. <laughs> okay. How do I seduce him? Oh yeah, look at me. I'm a moth. Oh yeah, I'm like a moth, dude. Or a scroll. Whichever one you prefer. <laughs> Whichever one is sexier. Let's see. Where'd, where'd Serana go to? Do I actually need to, like, sleep here or something to get it to, to progress? Did I somehow revert my vampirism a little bit? Hang on, let's... Fuck it. Let's go for 20... <laughs> Let's go for let's go for 13 hours. We'll be responsible. 14. There we go. Perfect.
perfect. Keep an eye on the top left. I'm feeling a surge of vampiric power. I'm surging a bit. D am I seductive now? Hey Cicero, look at me. Am I am I seductive? <laughs> am I am I sexy yet? <laughs> Cicero, am I am I sexy yet or what? Come on. <laughs> uh, let's see. I still don't have anything that refers to me being seductive. What the fuck? <laughs> Did it bug out? Did it bug out or something? Surely I don't turn into a nasty guy and then do it. Surely it's not in this form that we're seductive. Right? It can't be the case. Oh shit. Okay. He says to the man, Maybe if I just talk to him while I'm like this? No? <laughs> the fuck do I do it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Alright, do I need to sleep again? I mean, I can do it. I can do that. Let's see. Maybe our vampiric powers will evolve again. Yeah, another surge. I'm surging in power. I'm hungry. Your vampiric powers grow as you hunger. Vampire seduction added. Okay. Where was it the before? Yeah, let's let's just read through all this stuff. Updating in the top left. Okay, that's it. That's it. Okay. Oh yeah, it's a, it's a power. Creatures and people up to level 18 won't fight for 30 seconds. Can I actually use it as a nasty guy? Can I get nasty and then use it? No, I can't. I can only, like, use bats. Okay, let's revert form. This can't be healthy. <laughs> Transforming back and forth so much. Okay. Alright. Good. Let's seduce him. Let's seduce him. Hey. No. If you think I'll help you, you're mistaken. <laughs> he's just been here for days. <laughs> he's been here for days. I mean, come on. He's he was here for days as well, right? Coughing up or spewing blood in some f form, right? <laughs> Look, it's not that far fetched. It's not that weird. We saw the blood uh, elsewhere. It was just building up to this point to like establish this as being believable. <laughs> All right. There we go. Man, it's just like using Telvani bug musk, huh? What's up? I can feed on him? Okay, why not? Sure. Did that work? Oh god, I hope it did, because I just got rid of my ability to seduce him. <laughs> Alright, uh... Hey, let's By talk. The divines. It's as if my eyes have been opened. I am blinded by the light of your majesty. I... I must obey you. Oh, yeah. What would you have of me, master? Oh, oh, I command you to travel to Castle Volkahar. You know where that is, right? Certainly. Where can I find this castle? It's up there. <laughs> Off the northern coast of Skyrim, due west of Solitude. Nice of them to include this. I will set out at once, then. Okay. What's he got? Oh, an Akaviri sword, of course. Where'd you come from? My wife. Uh -oh. Are we good? Is yeah, he's going there. He's he look. He's just going faster now. That's fine. Yeah, he's just he's running now. Okay. Where did Serana go? I thought she was here with us, for real. She was duking it out and everything. Can I take this thing back? Nah. I need, like, a crowbar to pry it out. Fair enough. Oh, did the braziers ignite, too? That's where all the lighting came from? Huh. Cool. Alright. Check over here. Scroll of Guardian Circle. I guess I'll take that. Okay. 
sure. Don't need any healing. Is there any other section that we need to check in here? Got some money on that dude. I feel like we've checked everything, but maybe not. Let's go look at the upper area. We'll scope it out. Just in case there's some little fun bonus. Is there a little fun bonus up here? No. Yeah, where'd Serana go to? She didn't even say goodbye. She didn't even get to see me as I became, like, a little sexy guy. A little weird sexy guy. <laughs> she didn't even get to see all that. What the hell? Especially after <laughs> after we had the option to, like, come on to her. <laughs> Alright. Does the vampire seduction work on other vampires? I guess it would if they were... Or no, because are vampires technically classified as undead? Yes, yeah, so it would not work. Okay. Anything over here? Hmm. No, nothing else. And look at how that's like blasting out of there. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I like the, the fun little vampire architecture, you know? That said, it is it does make it kind of like... <laughs> you know, if you are in the Dawn Guard, it's a dead ringer if you go peek inside of a cave real quick and you see that, you're like, Oh shit, there's definitely vampires in here, right? <laughs> shit, they got the, they got the rails? Mmm, this looks like a banister for vampires. <laughs> right, what the fuck? Okay. Going up this way. Fucking anytime you see a gargoyle. Instant red flag that vampires are afoot. Hey! Hey, she's back out here! You didn't see me seduce the moth priest! Yes. Okay. Sure. Oh. Perfect timing. We just need to go- yeah, we need to go back to Harkon. How do, you, how do you say it? Volkahar. Volkahar. Right? That's it. Alright. Let's get Bend Will at the ready here. Hopefully this dragon does not fuck off too much. Nailed it. Oh, okay. We're killing this thing. I'm trying to ride it, though. There we are. All right, everybody chill. Great. All right, and then head on over to the castle. Great. Cool. Man, good thing the, uh, the spell effect there. Just, you know, it lasts really long. <laughs> <laughs> right, it may say that it only lasts like, what, 30 seconds or whatever, but that ain't true. It lasts as long as it takes for that fucking guy to walk out here. <laughs> Alright. Look, the duration on it, it was open to interpretation. It was Elder Scrollsy into the max. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's head on up and in. Let's clear skies. Oh shit, no, I can't. I've been bending the will of dragons too much. Man, see, this is what we should have done. <laughs> too bad we couldn't- Man, all we had to do to get all this shit done- Like, look at this fucking asshole. Who is this? Who is this little creep over here? Y'all see this little creep? Yo, are you with Dawn Guard? Oh, yeah, you are. You little- You little freak. Get out of here. We're the creeps! We're vampires! You're over here slunking around on our vampire beach? Fuck off, dude, you little freaky dude! <laughs> what, a little, what a little nasty guy! What the hell? Alright, good. Are we- are we good to go? Yeah, now we are. Shit, how am I supposed to suck these people off? I can't suck off anybody, huh? 
Look, there's another one of them in there. Our dragon's like gonna eat them. All right, let's run up here. Okay. Do you have power? No, you're like a some kind of baby. God, hopefully I can suck her off. What the hell? Oh Jesus, she's gonna murder me. She's gonna fucking murder me, dude! <laughs> ah! Revert, revert, revert! Revert form! Ugh. Okay. Go healing! Stand still! No! Okay. Do I still have my my other power, my shout of strength? How do I activate my Shout of Strength? What is it called? <laughs> what is it called again? Dragon Aspect! Once per day, I slept a whole no. bunch. Protein. There we go. I activate my Dragon Aspect and I vamp out again. Leave me alone, I'm vamping real quick. Sorry, hang on, I gotta prepare to suck you off. I can't just do it on command. <laughs> I have to turn on my orange and then get my meat stuff going on. Gosh, she's gonna kill me! Oh god! Tough day for you. Oh my gosh, and Serana's gonna suck her off instead! Fuck! You can't even suck anybody off! Shit, this is hard as hell. Man, it was so much better being a Wolverine werewolf ass motherfucker running around just eating hearts out of dead ass people and shit. Man, I could clear a whole dungeon, but now I gotta suck the blood while they're alive? <laughs> Why can't I just suck them off when they're already dead? It's still good, right? It's still good. Is there like a magic aspect to it? It has to be from a beating heart? No, it, it's it's not true. It's a lie. Anyone who tells you that is lying, because we can drink from the potions and it works, right? Oh shit! Though I guess it doesn't give us perk advancement, does it? Fuck! Fuck! They're right. They've owned me. They fucking got me. No! All right. Jesus. Meanwhile, I'm freezing my fucking ass off out here, trying to suck all these spies off, and it's not working at all. Okay. Who, who, who is even like a good target for us to suck off? Do we just need to start like running into towns, like sucking people off, like nobody's business or what? Shit. Go after skeevers or something? Like if I shoot these birds, all right. If I shoot a bird with my vampiric power, is it gonna fucking count or what? Right? Is it gonna count? Hey, look, we don't get cold as a vampire. Okay. Hang on a sec. If I hit a fucking bird with this, do I get perk progress? Where's a good bird? There we go. Yo! Apparently birds don't fucking count. Look, come on. I'm like a part bat creature. It should count. <laughs> Man, that was amazing. I can't believe we got it so quick. <laughs> All right. Oh God, it's in <laughs> the birds are freaks too. The birds are little nasty guys. Oh, they have scary heads and look, they move really fast. Look at them go. Jeez, it's like we're in fucking Gary's mod or Source Engine or some shit. Look at this. Okay. Oh, look at all this. Oh, for making the new jewelry. I didn't know you could source it from actual bone hawks or that they even existed. Hey, look. It's the moth what priest. Command? Yeah, it still works, huh? Hey, tell me, what do moth priests do exactly? It is our sacred duty to study the Elder Scrolls. We read these ancient scrolls of prophecy in order to divine the future. And we use that knowledge to aid the Emperor. Yeah, it Sometimes, didn't work out so well, has we it? We venture out into the world in search of more scrolls for our library at the White Gold Tower. That is the very purpose that first brought me to Skyrim. The White Gold Tower? 
It is the great spire at the heart of the Imperial City, among the tallest towers in all of Tamriel. The lower floors are home to the Imperial Council, and the Order of Moth Priests occupies the middle floors. The tower suffered damage in the recent war with the Aldmeri Dominion, and is not what it once was. I hope one day to see it restored to its former glory. Hmm. What do you know about the Elder Scrolls? Not as much as I would like. Yeah, Even you and after me spending broke. decades of my life in study of the Elder Scrolls, they remain a great mystery to me. It's true for most of my brothers in the Order as well. We don't really know where the scrolls came from or who wrote them. What we do know is that some are born with the special gift to read the Elder Scrolls. These chosen few can divine events of the past and future within the scrolls. Though in time, it drives us to blindness. I'm afraid there's not much more to tell. I didn't know there Even was today, certain people who could do it. I thought enigma. anybody could, it just came with the cost. Okay. Very well, Master. Yeah, I thought that just anybody could read an Elder Scroll, but you got the drawback, right? And some people could absorb more punishment than others, right? And that was it. Not that, like, only some people could read it, period, you know? All right, well, let's head on in. There we go. Good. Is it warm in here? Are we gonna, like, start warming up or what? Should I hang out over here? <laughs> I think... Okay, there we go. It is warm. Great. I don't want to, like, fall over dead while we're doing this little bit here. What is your command? Very well, Master. Is he plotting to overthrow him to show up? Hmm? What? What, what meeting? I wasn't informed of any such thing. Oh, I see. Well, I just assumed he'd sent for both of us. How awkward for you. Okay, they're just having like a fucking comedy act back there. <sighs> is that your voice? Who is this? Oh, Hesla. Sorry, I can't hardly see anybody. I'm like really cold. <laughs> okay. Well done. Somehow I knew it would be you who found our moth priest. Yeah, right, yeah. How many people did you send out to do this? <laughs> well done. Okay, yeah. Somehow I knew it would be you who found our moth priest. I've made the moth priest my thrall. Yes, I see that. I trust his capture was not too difficult to task. Yeah, Dawn Guard tried to stop me, but they posed no threat. The Dawn Guard were there. They fought well, but not well enough. The Dawn Guard were protecting him, and they nearly killed me. <laughs> Hell yes, we're clicking that. Yo, the Dawn Guard fucked me up. I couldn't even suck anybody off hardly. It was like impossible. Two of them were out there. I tried to suck them off. I couldn't even do it, man. It was terrifying. Gosh, I, I'm, I've got one perk or two perks. I want more, but I can't. <laughs> And when Saran is with me, my power is so, like, shit, it, it's horrible. <laughs> they, they nearly kill, killed me. We both know that a band of fools with crossbows is no match for a scion of the ancient blood. I admit, I do not entirely understand your sense of humor. Well, your thrall <laughs> awaits and we have given him the Elder Scroll. Command him to read it. And let us hear the words of prophecy together. I get that comment every day on a video at this rate. <laughs> All right. If you need anything, say the word. Let's see at over here. Oh shit! Hang on. I Do you have anything the power else? Of the ancient blood in your veins. It has made you strong. Go okay. Then. Cool. And do not forget who is your master. All right, what's up? Master, I have done as you asked and traveled here. Surprised Good. Well, I have a new task for you, Thrall. Of course. What is it that you need me to do? I start reading, buddy. You must read an Elder Scroll. Ah, yes. The Elder Scroll. I admit, I am looking forward to this. 
Then you may begin your reading. Of course, Master. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the knight's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes. Wow, what I a ripoff. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens, and I see no more. Man, we got you stuck with the table prophecy. of contents? What the we fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Surprised you weren't at the last meeting with our Lord. All right. What is your command? Mm, that's right now, I guess. Return. What? What? What meeting? I wasn't informed right. of any such. Thing. Hey, did that you hear all that? Not as useful as I would have liked. Even so, you did well. How awkward for you. Do you know where these other scrolls are? My traitor wife stole one of them away and then disappeared. As for the other, the last that I heard, it was lost in the bowels of a Duema ruin. It seems our work is not yet done. But I have waited this long, and we are so very close now. I can wait a bit longer. God, I love how divorced he is. <laughs> Yo, he's like the most divorced the man word. in all of Tamriel, huh? Or at least in Skyrim, right? <laughs> okay. Uh oh, Serana gonna approach with a little a bit of input. Okay, okay, we're good. Buy back the Elder Scroll Dragon from. Okay. Find the Elder Scroll Blood. Find the Elder Scroll Dragon. Okay. And also, doesn't the contents of the Elder Scrolls, it like changes over time, right? Like sometimes they, the contents, like not only can the location of an Elder Scroll like warp, it goes different places, but literally what it says can warp as well, right? I want to say that's the case, but maybe not. It's very, uh, it's all very open interpretation. All right, well. <laughs> I suppose when next we come back, we will uh, chat up Serana once more. Maybe we'll check in with more folks. We'll get another uh, Radiant quest going. Uh, there's quite a few, actually, and a few unique ones, evidently. Right, I didn't uh, have the wherewithal to write anything down ahead of time, but folks wrote in last time with that information. And, uh, hey, definitely want to do them all if we possibly can. All right, until next time, please take care of each other.